Hello there guys, are you dreaming of starting your own business but you are worrying about your capital? Good news! You don't need to have a huge capital to start your own business. So if you are interested, you got to listen to this videos that will make you wealthy and debt free. Hi there, this is Shinky Tan, your Pambansang Wealth Coach. Maraming salamat for tuning in. So ngayon, pag-usapan natin bakit um, ganda na mag-start po na business na walang kapital and then ano yung mga magagandang ideas and then also we're gonna talk about ano yung mga pitfalls and then finally I'm gonna share with you some tips and success that I personally have used and done uh, that I started my business without any capital so eto kung pag-uusapan po natin ang uh, let's say starting the business without capital ang pinaka best talaga na startup talaga is to start your business from home bahay. Bakit bahay po? Kung mapapansin nyo, by the way, I'm Filipino-Chinese, obvious ba? Pero hindi ako lumaki sa farm. Honor, lumaki po ako sa farm? What? <laughs> As a Filipino-Chinese, kung mapapansin nyo, kadalasan po yung business model po namin, ground floor, tindahan, second floor bahay. Again, if you notice that from Binondo, sa Ongpin, di ba? Karamihan yan, ground floor, tindahan, second floor bahay. Bakit po? Just in case, walang benta, walang lugi. Bakit? Walang babayaran na upa at hindi pwedeng isara ang bahay. <laughs> That's number one. Ang kagandaan din, pag home base ka, flexible ang oras mo. You can work around your schedule, di ba? Lalo na kung may commitments ka. Uh, I've been actually working from home for over, I think, 12 to 13 years already. Di ba? And then, syempre, aside from that, pag home base ka, wala kang babayaran na transportation fee, pagkain, di ba? Ang laki po ng ikang matitipid mo. Guys, if you just know what I'm trying to say, you would understand what I mean. <laughs> So that's number one. Kung kaya kung gusto niyo mag-business, home base. Pero ito lang, ha? ito lang po. May mga warning lang ako. Warning lang before I talk about yung anong mga potentials that you can get into. Uh, number one, ano yung mga pagkakamaliin naman ng mga home base business? Number one is overworking. Yun nga, ang problema kasi since naka-work from home ka na, minsan hindi mo na alam kung ano yung oras ka matatapos. Kaya it's very important as you start working from home, kailangan meron ka pa ring mindset, no? Parang let's say 8 to 5, 9 to 5, after 5 o'clock, no, you stop, 'di ba? Lunch time, you take a break. So, yun yun. That's number one. There's a tendency of overworking. And there's also a tendency not also of overworking pang home base ka or underworking. When you say underworking, since comfortable ka na, so gigising ka ng 11 to 12, pagkatapos yan, manunood ka na ng Netflix pag tinamad ka ng konti na hindi mo na mamalayan na uubos mo na yung oras mo. So there are two sides of the coin. Either you overwork or you underwork. So again, It's all about building routine, building habit, and building discipline in order for you to succeed when you want to work from home. So right now, let's talk about opportunities. Opportunities naman tayo. Again, number one, ang pinakambest niyan talaga, kung gusto mo talaga mag-start ng home base na wala kang masyadong kapital, go into selling. Oh. Uh, selling like for example, real estate, insurance, di ba? direct selling, mga ganun. Kasi ang gagandaan, ang pumunan mo lang dyan na Hawaii. And FYI lang po. Uh, wag kayong maghabol din ng immediate income when you want to start your own home-based business. Maybe you're asking why. Kasi ang goal mo talaga sa unang encounter mo pag sumali ka sa ganitong opportunity is not to earn money but to earn and gain experience. To earn and gain confidence. Listen. Listen. Pakinggan mo ako itong mabuti. The money will follow if you learn how to sell. Kasi nga, ang parating gusto natin makabenta na yun. Pero it, imagine mo to, ah. Selling is a new skill that you have to acquire unless na matagal ka na nagbebenta. Kasi imagine mo, you were trained to become a, an accountant. You were trained to become a engineer. Or probably you were trained to become a nurse. And then all of a sudden, switch profession. Papasok ka sa sales in zero knowledge, zero experience, zero exposure. Kaya nga, give yourself at least 6 months to 1 year. 6 months to 1 year to learn. To learn, not to earn. Anyway, ang gagawin mo naman, kung gusto mo, um, you keep your job, do this as your part-time and sideline and side hustle. That's number one. Number two, kung pagkatapos ka, natuto ka na, pwede naman, ay, chinky, masyadong mahirap yung face-to-face and everything. Ako, ayaw mo naman face-to-face selling. Eh, di online selling. Maraming platforms na nagbebenta online, tulad na Shopee, Lazada, TikTok, Facebook, Marketplace. Diba? You can get a product and start promoting it online. And the good thing about uh, online selling, siyempre, 
walang overhead, social media, posting, hindi nagsasara tindahan mo, open ka 24-7. Di ba maganda? So, a third opportunity, guys, na pwede mong pagkakitaan ngayon is freelancing. I'm sure narinig mo na yan. Kung may skills ka sa writing, graphic design, social media management, di ba? Or ads. Ang grabe, ang dami na talaga ngayon. Ang dami na talagang opportunity ngayon sa online, sa freelancing services. O kunyari, may kakilala kang mga taong nahihirapan na magbenta. Tulungan mo sila magbenta. May tao ka bang kakilala na nahihirapan na magsunat? Tulungan mo sila magsunat. May kakilala ka bang tao na nahihirapan na sila mag-organize ng mga thoughts and ideas? Tulungan mo sila. Ang daming opportunity right now. Or if that, another opportunity, online tutorial services. Iba pwede ka magturo ng math, Filipino, English, foreign language. O di ba? Kung gusto mo naman, I'm ng freelancing, virtual assistant. Di ba? Nagaanap ng mga administrator, secretary, assistant, taga-set ng schedule. So, kung makikita mo talaga, ang dami po ng opportunity. Maybe right now you're asking, Chinky, okay, I'm sold to the idea, I like all your ideas, but how do I start? Okay, so if you want to start, this is what you need to do. Number one, identify muna your strength and capability. Saan ka ba magaling? That's where we all start. Kung magaling ka talaga, ako, I have the gift of some, taking something that's very complicated and make it very simple for people to understand. Uh, yan ang gift ko talaga. Kaya kung may problema kayo, diba? naguguluhan kayo, lapitan nyo ako. <laughs> Tawagan nyo ako, kausapin nyo ako. Oo. So if you want to be part of my coaching group, uh, I give also group coaching and one-on-one coaching session. If you want to have time with me, especially if you're a business owner, medyo confused ka, hindi mo alam gagawin. All you need to do is just go to chinkfree.com, C-H-I-N-K-F-R-E-E.com and may makikita kayong link doon na uh, group coaching or personal coaching. Just fill up the form. So, number one, identify w- where you're good at. Number two, identify your target market. Sino ba yung target market you want to help? And then, syempre, alamin mo kung anong problem nila, anong pain point nila, anong solution na pwede mong i-offer. Sulat mo yan. Anong problem, pain point nila, any solution na pwede mo offer and then from there you create already your product and services that you want to offer that's where you start simple lang ulitin ko ah what you're good at target market di ba after that problem pain point solution after that you create the product to be able to help your target market that's it pansit <laughs> and then syempre some of you are saying chinky Mabilis para sa iyo pero mahirap po para sa amin. Nako, kasi hindi naman namin alam kung paano mag-uumpisa, paano nitty-gritty diyan. Well, if you found this video helpful and you want to do the nitty-gritty session on how I can help you to start, to launch, or to grow your business. Ulitin ko, ah, three stages yan. Start, launch, and grow your business. If you need help, I have great news. I'm going to offer a master class to be able to help you achieve that. This will be almost one whole day from 2pm up to 8pm to eh. And the good news is, hindi lang ako ang kasama dito. I will be with no other than one of the most influential and successful business entrepreneur also and then a teacher and also a practitioner no other than Boss RDR. Kami dalawa, we will come together called Nego Ascenso. And FYI, this will not be a free event. This will be a paid event. Bakit? Because we want to qualify if you're really serious. Because we're going to invest our time. And I can assure you, I can assure you, marami na po ang natulungan ng session na ito. If you want to know more about it, all you need to do is just go to the description section. May link po there. And then please click the link so that you can know more. Maraming maraming salamat. Guys, thank you very much for tuning in. I hope that I'm able to help you, inspire you to give you an idea already on how you can start your home-based business without any capital or little capital. Maraming maraming salamat. As I always say, to every problem, there's always a solution. If you're not part of the solution, you're part of the problem. Always. Chimpastin. Bye.